Hello, Brave Awakened Ones. Veronica of Hiram Holistics here. I want to make this really quick video, and it is just to talk about um, the reaction. And I'm talking about reaction and not responses because these are reactions, not responses, to the videos that I made this morning when it comes to forgiveness um, and what is going on and how, you know, about the modern day trade slave uh, the slave trade thing and um you know how i remote viewed you know what was going on on a uh, ship <coughs> cargo ship in, in uh california harbor um to what was going on and i uh, had some very angry 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 um responses on both reactions on both of the videos i made this morning and um about forgiving now, I haven't mentioned this before, but something very important that was told to me, quote unquote, was once you taste the blood of the innocent, there is no going back. And that had to do with Trump when he was taken to Epstein's Island on what made him turn back and decide to be part of the alliance and figure out that this whole thing of of uh, ascension and the awakening is for real and that it's not just you know there's more to just making your billions in this lifetime it, it's a lot deeper than that so that's what made him turn around okay from going from Epstein's Island it forced him to turn around where he decided I need to do what I need to do to save my soul and help the soul of my kids Okay, again, once you taste the blood of the innocent, there's no turning back. So all those, your favorite celebrities that you think are so cool, that we all know are part of the Illuminati, they're, they're spirit cooking, they taste the blood of the innocent, okay? And when I say no turning back, meaning their souls don't get to ascend. It's about them, you know, depending on how much light is left in them, but once you taste the blood of the innocent, there's no turning back your your soul is literally it implodes upon itself once it leaves this body this is why they're so stuck to this life this is why they so don't want to leave this existence this body because once you taste the blood of the innocent the only way to keep alive is by to keep doing that because their light and their life source is what's keeping you alive you you already gave up yours. You sold yours, basically. Okay? So that's what's going on with that. And when I say forgiving them, it's... <laughs> forgiveness, again, may sound cliche, but it is for you. You are forgiving them for you because when you stick with that rage and anger in your heart, it eats you up. It doesn't allow you to help the people you're supposed to be helping because you're so taken up by need some light here Ugh. you're so taken up by anger and hatred you forgive them to release them knowing that they are being reabsorbed back into source basically that's it they are being reabsorbed back into source that is what I mean by forgiving and for those that did not cross that line, such as a Trump and many others, like I know there's like this Dutch banker that um, was doing all the horrible things. And then he went up to the point where they're like, OK, well, now to be part of us, you're going to have to do this. Literally taste the blood of the innocents. And that's when he turned around and was like, no, and gave it all up and, you know, and exposed everything that was going on. He did this fascinating interview. Uh, I think it was in German. He, he did it in German. Um, so that's what I mean. by And for, forgiving those people. The ones that taste the blood of the innocent. There is no going back for them. But you still have to forgive them too. Because if you hang on to that rage. You're hurting nobody but yourself. And you're not going to be able to help anyone in that state. Because you're just so angry trying to take out stuff on someone and something that is not under your control not under your control and you can't be mad at the alliance saying oh the alliance should do this and do that no guess what we're part of the alliance all us light workers this is what we're here to do we're here to help sleep help free gaia and the those that dwell, up, dwell upon gaia that is what we're here for the the lie was thick okay 
the 3D matrix was thick. We took it down. There's cleaning up to do at this time. Okay, that is your focus. Revenge is not your focus because you know what? You, you're going to go down their road if you think that's, that's, where, that's where your focus is, is revenge and anger and hatred and everything like that and unforgiveness. It's not to pardon what they did. It's not to say they skinned. Please, honey, I worked where I saw kids come in that were abused in those ways. I had to counsel kids that went through that shit, literally, physically went through that. We're part of sacrifices. I had to counsel to these twins that saw their three, two-year-old baby sister be raped to death by their mom's pimp, okay? And then had to send cops out there to uncover the baby's body underneath the trailer. So please, I had to not kill a father who I saw having a daughter perform a sexual act on him. And I did not want him coming to visit her because he just got released for jail for molesting her. But I had to allow him to come see her. I had to put him in a headlock to hold till security came because his ass was high and drunk anyway so I could overpower him. Trust me, it took forgiveness to not kill him. It took forgiveness not to do that. Okay? And on top of it, while I was thinking I'm helping the girl, she's on top of me pulling my, trying to pull my hair out to tell me, get off her dad. She loves him. Imagine that. The person you're trying to save from drowning is the one trying to kill you. So, yeah, so people, that is where we are, all right, when it comes to being light workers and rising above that energy, okay? Forgiving them does not exonerate them of their quote unquote sins, does not exonerate them of what they did because they have tasted the blood of the innocent. So, therefore, they lose their souls, basically. They, their souls get cremated, it implodes, reabsorbed back into source. That's that, okay? You don't have any control over that. That's not, that's not for you to do, okay? So your focus is to help those who are ready to be helped, to lift up, all right? Lady V out, HigherRealmHolistics.com. Okay, we got this, all right? Bye. <laughs>